This prank is absolutely insane. So this guy, Zachary, lives out of state with his aunt. He met a girl online named Victoria. She lives in Mexico, and since then they've been in a long-distance relationship. Zachary's mom lives several states away, but she's worried that he might end up visiting Victoria and potentially doing something stupid or get himself in trouble. Now Zachary told me to call his mother as Victoria's father, Pedro, and say that she's nine weeks pregnant with Zachary's baby. The call opens up with his mom thinking that someone's playing a little joke on her, but shortly afterwards she starts taking things very, very seriously. Hello? Yeah, uh, c c can I speak with uh, Rhonda, please? Hello? Yeah, Rhonda, I I'm calling about Zachary. <laughs> I, <laughs> I knew it had something to do with Zachary. I didn't know if it was Zachary or a friend of Zachary's. So, <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's smart, Alec. Yeah, so I... Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I, okay. Well, you. you uh, I, I'm glad you're you're in a good mood because you know I wanted to talk to you about something you know very important. Okay. Well, what did you want to talk about? Yeah, I'm calling. You know, my my daughter. I I, I getting from her. I asked her to find. You know, to give me Zachary mother phone number to to call you guys and kind of just talk about our, our kids and, and 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 you know what what happened. Okay, well, first off, who is your daughter? Uh, my, my daughter is uh, Victoria Juarez. Victoria Juarez? See. Si. Oh, it's just a friend that... Uh, we knew that our son was talking to a girl named Victoria. See. Si. But we si. don't know much about that. Uh, yeah, yeah, see, si, I am her father. I, I, that's why I was calling you. Okay, so what do you know that I don't know? Because you said something happened. What happened? Yeah, you know, I, I, I am surprised too, but I'm, I'm very excited. Uh, you know, Victoria is saying uh, she's uh, nine weeks pregnant. Excuse me? Uh, she, uh, could you say that again? Yeah, see, I, 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 you know, they, I don't know if they don't, you know, like, um, you know, be careful or something, but Victoria... In, uh, well, I was told that he hasn't even met her yet. Oh, no, they, they, uh, they, they spend time together. Huh. Yeah, so I wanted to see, you know, we're trying to figure out all the, the, the details and things like this. My daughter, she wants to, I, I tried to make it a little bit later, she wanted to have it soon, but we're trying to pick out a, a place for the wedding probably sometime in October. Oh, okay, well, first off, I need to talk to my son because I don't know about any of the, I, we had been told that they hadn't even met yet, and... Now you're telling me that she's how many weeks pregnant? Yeah, nine nine weeks. Nine weeks. And what is your name again, sir? Yeah, I, I am Pedro. Pedro. Pedro Juarez. See. So well, no, see, you have to understand, my son likes to call and play jokes on us with different accents and things, and that's why I was laughing, because usually he tends to call and play jokes on me and his dad, and then we get confused as to who's calling us, and so as soon as you said something about Zachary, I thought that it was a friend, he put a friend up to calling us. Um, oh. I apologize for that. Oh, it's okay. I was, I was very confused. You know, I saw you guys were, you know. No, with... I can understand that you would be confused because, uh, you know, our son, he likes to play jokes on us and stuff. So, um, yeah. I have you, I have your number down at 717 yeah, but porque the, the telephone get here a little bit expensive, so I tried to call from the calling car. But, you know, I, I can call you back later, but I wanted to just talk about, you know, what we can do. You know, I, I my, my daughter, you know, be, very excited, you know, but I want to see if we can, you know, start to, you know, maybe put our money together or something like this for, you know, a shower baby or, you know, we can try to, you know, we, we, we're going to have a family. Right. Uh, well... I didn't realize we were going to have a familia because I didn't realize that my son and your daughter had even met. I know, <laughs> so, but I better, uh, yeah, please I, understand I'm a little shocked here, or taken aback, actually, yeah, yeah, because... I, I was shocked, too, you know, but, you know, I'm also excited, you know, you're going to be a grandmother. You're going to be a grandmother. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> Two times over, it would seem. So, um, have you talked to my son yeah, ever yeah, on the yeah, phone? Yeah, yeah. We talk a little bit. You know, I tell him, you know, once you plant a seed like this, you know, you have to marry her now. And he say, okay, I, I very much love her. And he seemed very willing. You know, I asked him. I also wanted to talk to him because for some reason he was, I don't know, he, he got a little bit carried away or something. But all over, Victoria, her, her neck, all over, there is like a kisses, right? Like, like, the, like I guess he sucked her neck or something like this. I, don't, I forget the name. Uh, hold on. What? Sylvia, what is the name for uh, para el, uh, the letter? Oh, uh, oh, the hickey, hickey. Uh, sorry, hickey. Uh, okay, well, that's probably a little too much information for me, but thank you for getting in touch with me, and uh, I, we will work this out and do what we need to do. Okay, so. excellent, but number one, number one thing, I know you're going to be a, a little bit very concerned, but number one, you have to remember, you're going to be a grandmother! <laughs> <laughs> yes, I would seem so. So, uh, yeah. Okay. Thank you very much for letting us know. No problem. But, but, but one question, okay. you, because I want to tell him, Victoria, do you have any, do you have any preference for, for the name, if it's a girl or a boy? Because she's asking me, you know, if I have something for her, I want to ask you out with respect. You know, I want to ask you to... Oh, oh goodness, no, no, no. I would leave that up to her and Zachary. Okay. I, I, I would, yeah, no, that would be their decision, well, not mine. You know, I thought maybe you want to call her if as a girl we can do Ronda Jr. Hey, you, hey. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll I'm be gonna, in touch. Okay, I'm going to be a grandfather. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, okay, bye-bye. Okay, bye-bye. <laughs> Dude, the fucking screaming. My neighbors. <laughs> oh, my God, at this point, Zach's mom tried frantically calling his aunt to figure out what the hell is going on. Especially since I told Zach not to answer any calls from her yet. And she called him a bunch. I got a hold of the voicemail she left. Here it is. Hey, sir, it's me. I know you're at work, and I shouldn't have called you again. But, um, just a little bit. I don't know what you would call me. Maybe freaked out, maybe upset. I don't know. But I had received a call from a Pedro Juarez saying that my son had gotten his daughter, Victoria Juarez, pregnant, and she's nine weeks pregnant. And if this is a joke, which I know is a pretty funny man he thinks he is, uh, then it's one thing, but he should know better than to joke like that. Secondly, if this is real, so help him, he better pray that he is in right standing with God, because I will be on the next flight to and I will kill him myself. So if you could have my son give me a call and let me know what it is, I'd really appreciate it. Thank you. I hope everything's going great for y'all. I love y'all. And I'll talk to you later. Now I have Zach on the line and want him to call his mom to speak with her. Just so I can hear how crazily she reacts when finally getting a hold of him. Here's what went down. Hello? Hey, Dad. Are you by yourself? I'm in, the, I'm in the emergency room. You take your mom to the hospital. She passed out. What? Okay, so this prank unfortunately did not go down the way I hoped. But I figure it's only fair to show you guys some pranks that do go wrong. And this one went very, very wrong. But before you jump to any conclusions, you should definitely, definitely check out the prank reveal down below. You do not want to miss what happens. Thank you all so much for watching. Please give the video a big thumbs up and hit that share button if you enjoyed the unique concept. And of course, don't forget to watch the prank reveal down below. I'll see you subscribers next Sunday. Is, is, your, is your wife okay? She's in the hospital right now. What did you do to her? What did you say?